Hi, I'm Brian with Green Hat Kiteboarding, and today I'm going to go over how to get uh, a bolt that may be seized in the bottom of uh, an aluminum mast here. If you don't use uh, Loctite, the threads will actually corrode into the mast. Um, and you'll be trying to get this undone, and it's not going to go. Um, first, really important to make sure you have the proper uh, Allen key, that it's super tight in here. If it has wiggle room, you're going to want to get a better Allen key, because if not, you'll strip it. So if it is stuck, you can't get it undone, then we're going to grab a torch. We're going to try to heat the uh, mast right here. Uh, by heating the mast, you'll actually expand the metal, and it'll allow the bolt to come out the end. Uh, this torch, just a propane torch, uh, you can buy it at a hardware store. Um, it's for plumbing, you know, nothing special in particular. Uh, you're definitely going to want some gloves. Uh, it's going to get super hot as we heat it. Um, and you may want some safety glasses. So here, I'm going to show you how to get this off. So as you're heating the mass, again, heating the mass, not the actual bolt, you want to do it evenly, okay, on both sides. You're trying to you're not trying to burn the actual metal. You could, if you leave it in one spot, you'll actually get black spots on the metal, the aluminum. And being careful, this metal here is extremely hot, so just make sure you don't bump yourself. Just like that. We have freed up a corroded, corroded bolt. Again, you'd only want to do this on aluminum mass. If you have a carbon fiber mass uh, that has a seized bolt, by heating it, you'll actually just melt the carbon fiber and destroy the foil. As you can see, there's a lot of corrosion on the bolts here. Um, I'll just clean these up, and next time I put them in, I'll use Loctite. If you happen to strip out the uh, threads here with the Allen key, uh, I recommend using a Dremel, and you'll create basically a groove right across it uh, to get a flathead screwdriver on it, a big flathead screwdriver. So if you do strip the threads out, it's not the end of the world, uh, you just need a Dremel. And that's how you get a bolt out of a aluminum mist.